today I'll be talking about my unpopular opinion on Call of Duty Vanguard. Let's go. First segment, how the game looks. In my personal opinion, I think the game looks so-so. You know, it's going to be good, but it might also be bad. Like Cold War. We all know how Cold War turned out. We thought it was going to be the best game ever. Cool game, awesome, top, you know, this game to do. And, you know, we all have our opinions. Like, our opinions, uh, yeah, we all have our opinions. Some people say it's good, but, you know, most majority of people say it's trash. The opinions opinionify that the game, or the, the other people's opinions opinionify that their opinions are, they think the game is bad. Yeah, I confused myself. <laughs> yeah, they think Cold War is gonna, or it sucks, it really just sucks, you know? Back to Vanguard. Vanguard to me, I'm 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 kind of excited for it, not really, but I'm just for me what I do personally, I wait a week before the game comes out, like Cold War. We all know how that turned out, but I wait a week before the game comes out. I'm start I'm gonna start doing this now. I'm gonna wait a week before the game comes out and then see how people think about it and stuff. Now I've seen Jev, I'll tell other people I've no friends and stuff, you know, YouTubers play this game and they say it's it's pretty good. It's except except for the, the glitches and bugs, which we'll be talking about in a different segment. They say it's it, it's kind of, it's pretty good, especially since it's running on the Modern Warfare 2019 engine, which I'm loving. I love hearing, and you know what else they have? The you know the breakable doors and stuff, you know, and all that kind of jazz, you know, which you'll see in the game if you get it or not. Or people make videos. Check out FaceJev and some other people. I'm I'll link in the description if I remember, which I probably will not. Um. Anyways, next segment, cause there's nothing else to talk about in the segment except for something else that I'll talk about in the next segment. Let's go. Now, guns and maps. I honestly think these, from what I saw, the guns, they look like a classic World War II game. Since, you know, this game is going to be World War II, which is not really that exciting. Because, you know, we all played like a million. Call of Duty was basically just based off World War. You know that? This game was based off World War. Which is, you know, and we're just seeing another one. And then they had World War II come in. And now we have Call of Duty Vanguard. But I heard, so there's like, I think there's like five assault rifles, three SMGs, two shotguns, three LMGs, one marksman rifle, I think it was, um, two sniper rifles, and three hand, um, what's it called, pistols, and then two rocket, two type of launchers, and rocket launchers or whatever, and two type of melee weapons, which is, I think they're gonna have a riot show soon, I'm not sure about that, and then, you know, the knife or whatever. And a lot of guns that are, I heard that'll be coming. Um, I'm ready to list right now. It's a 1911, the three line rifle, the auto loading shotgun, the bar, which is ready in, the Bryn, the DP27, FSS, FS fighting knife, which is ready in the game, Carnade was also in the game. Okay, never mind, hold up. He's ready in the game. Never mind, I'm reading a list that is right. Act like I never said that. Anyways, the guns, they look like it, it, it might be good, you know? The guns, people, because I've been hearing the bar. It's, it's the bar, the Car 98, and, um, what's it called? The MP40, people, yeah, P MP40, not the, not the Car 98 or anything else. The MP40, people say the MP40 is really good, which, my, it, 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 when I saw it, it kind of reminded me of, like, a, um, like an MP5 and MP7, but just War II themed, you know? Yeah, that's just my opinion on it. Just, that's just me, me opinion on it. On the gun, or on, on the gun. On, I honestly think that, um, the guns this game might be, they, they might be, you know, what's the word? Um, not, part not particularly good, but bad, but like, decent. Like, it's, some of them might slap, but then, you know, Modern Warfare, they, they like to just add in random guns sometimes. Like, you know when they had this just psych off randomly? And they had the freaking dual auto, full auto, oh my, that was insane. Everybody, it, it, ugh, they ran around with that. It was just insane, which I hated a lot. Everybody hated it, but they also love using it, and that's what content came in for people. You know, the meme editors, you know what I'm talking about, y'all out there. Y'all made a whole bunch of videos, not, not a whole bunch of videos, like one or two videos on, you know, the Zykovs. Giving them gold, or you know, getting them, like, the masks, whatever, and then use the full auto make a little meme edit on them, you know? Now, let's on to the maps. So, I know, from what I heard, most of the maps are just 66, or after the years, it's just 66. 66? No, it's 2v2 to, um... 66, right? Yeah, 2v2, then 3v3, then 4v4, then 5v5, then 6v6. Okay, yeah. So I heard some of the maps are okay. Nobody said they're good, 
but I've I've been seeing lots of people play on Market and Courtyard and what's the one map? Um, Gavu Two Two, something like that. Gavu Two Two, I don't know. That Dome and Eagle's Nest, but Gavu Two. That's when I saw the first thing happen to people. You know that the one glitch where like uh, I don't know what it was the fidget spinner glitch. Remember what happened that in Warzone? That yes, actually, I don't, actually no, I'm talking about that in a different segment. But glitches that will come in on the next segment. But um. Yeah, um, these maps they don't they don't look ha ha bad in my opinion. I think like five maps are good. Well, because that's we're the only five maps I saw. I'll have to check them out later. The uh, Gavel Two, actually no, I'm gonna say four now because Gavel Two is okay. I like Dome Eagle's Nest. Um, what's it called? Market. Freaking, what's it called? Oops, sorry, I stopped my door. Air, not airship. Um, market. Yeah, was that four? Market. Eagle's Nest. Boom. Oh, well, that's already three then. I'm dumb. I can't count. Um, and yeah, my and since the engine is working, I know actually bringing from the first segment to this segment the destruct destructible stuff. I I know some walls in the game you can just bust through. Like somebody can be camping, bust through the walls. Somebody can just sit there with a um what a what a um freaking uh, freaking I don't know what a camping gun, bust through the wall and kill them. Somebody sitting there with petting their dog, bust through the wall. Who cares? Somebody's sitting there and eating food, bust through the wall, I don't care. Somebody's giving birth, bust through the wall, I don't care. Nobody cares. It's, <laughs> it just sounds, it sounds kind of cool to me, to be honest with you. He probably had like a cool trick shot, bust through the wall, or the wall, bust through the wall, or make a cool little transitions. You can go from like, go through here, you know, bust through the wall, transition to a different map, bust through the little, because I know I saw this little, um, what, what are they called? You know, use them for a window? I don't know what they're called though. Like a, like a window blocker thing, I don't know. Someone for your windows, the shades, whatever. You can bust through them and change to something else and do 360 and no scope or something. I don't know. A flip shot or, you know, whatever. But that's my opinion on the maps. And next segment, baby. Let's go. Now, glitches and bugs. Uh, on this, the game, the only reason why I'm not really looking forward to get the game is, um,. The glitches and bugs, or the, at least the beta now, because like it looks like it's basically just impossible to play. It's that, and I'm I'm kind of afraid of getting into like a game with just sweat, 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 because that literally all it is now. This game is just sweat on this, sweat on sweat, 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 sweat. There's no being good. There's just sweat. Uh, you buy all these packs, you buy all this stuff, you waste all your money on just some virtual things to look good in the game, just to and all this clicking and clacking. You know, Probably can't even hear the controller, but not even playing the game. You're just you're just playing just to show that like I'm better than all y'all and I'm the best in the game. And look at me, I can beat everybody. I'm what's his name? Who's the best? Scumpy? Scump? Face? Not face. Uh, what's his name? Scump guy. Whatever his name is. Scump God. I don't know. Not J God. J God is the one guy with the um. He's a he's a Warzone guy. Yeah, he's a Warzone guy. But yeah, the glitches and bugs—they don't look that good. I saw where um, if you aim into your sniper, the great the game just goes green or something like that, or you just can't even aim in, and the fidget spinner glitches back. Remember that from Warzone, where your gun just went bonkers and you just <laughs> you can't even really see anything. It was that, and I lost saw lots of other stuff like you look in the sky, like you know, like little firefights and little um the F the, the FX stuff, the sky FS F F X F X. Like the sky, and I saw just turn green and blah 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 blah, you know, turn stuff like that, just green, so you can't even see that. Like you shoot somebody, you look up for a second or whatever, and you get distracted by a by a Fourth of July, a redneck Fourth of July, shooting illegal fireworks in the sky, and you just it's just it's just crap. And all of a sudden, a freaking piece of it hits you, and you burns the back of your neck, and I have a scar that looks like somebody chopped your neck in half. Totally did not happen to me. I don't know. Next segment. Now, how the game feels, in my opinion, the game looks like it's gonna feel good. It's gonna feel like a, like a Call of Duty game, you know, like Cold War, where just you, you it, 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 they just basically just shove Cold War down your throat and saying, look, it's a game, it's Call of Duty, play it. You know, it's 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 revolutionary, it's Cold War, play the game, play the game. You're not cool like everybody else, you know. That's what everybody felt like. I think, maybe, maybe it's just me. I don't know, but 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 but. but. 
like that. But, but in my <gasps> hold up, gotta all right, Cold War the game, or not Cold War Vanguard. How it feels? Who? Okay, let me get back to the motion because I had a little bit of technical, little technical difficulties, and I just had to get back on track. Let's talk about how the game, how the game feels. Yes, how the game feels. It looks like it's gonna feel good. Anyways, on to the next segment because there's really nothing much to talk about this. Let's go. Now, is the game good? I particularly made this one for kind of you guys. I want you guys to tell me in the comments if you think the game is good or not. But I've been hearing a lot of people, you know, face Jeff and all people saying the game, because he's been like lots of videos, you know, his grind and stuff. And it's not that bad, you know? Not that bad. Not too, not bad, not good. Like, like me, my opinion, I think it's so so. Not bad, not good. But I personally might not get it. I might get it in a couple of videos now and then. On the game, like cool, I barely made, I paired the videos on Cold War. I made like two little cool edits because I had some two cool clips. I don't want the clips all the waste because I had them saved on my Xbox or whatever. And um, the game, it the graphics look pretty solid. The um, the features in the game look amazing. I heard some about the score streaks not being there, whatever the kill streaks, something they're not gonna be in the game. Uh, the guns look okay, the maps look okay, like I talked about in previous segments, and yeah. The game, I might, honestly, me, it might be good. I, I don't know. From what it looks now, it's kind of buggy and glitchy. Guns might be okay, but I think the gun, the game, might be good. You yeah. know. So guys, thank you for listening on my unpopular opinion on this game. See you guys later. And I'll see. You, have a good day. Yeah. Bye.